What do you think? Can you feel the warmth relax every muscle in your body? Yeah, it's so nice. The steam is warm too. The first time I came to the hot springs, there was no calming effect whatsoever. I was such a little ball of energy, the moment my parents looked away, I ran off to the high temperature pools. It was actually pretty funny looking back on it. They were absolutely frantic, looking for me all over, until finally they saw my head slowly poke out from under the water. I was too young to remember the whole ordeal, but my parents told me all about it. A natural born swimmer, my mother called me. Just like her, I taught myself how to dive underwater the first time I ever went swimming. So feel free to go for a swim. I'll be right here if you need rescuing. Okay, here goes nothing. <clears throat> Auntie Atea, you really came to check on us? <laughs> of course, and I'm glad you listened. I brought you all some milk and snacks as well. I'll just leave them here. <sighs> the temperature in the artificial springs isn't too high, so I went with Saurus crackers and grain fruit chips. See how you like them. Oh, thank you! Um, mm, these are great! Well, I did make them myself. <sighs> Very few young people know how to truly appreciate hot springs, so listen carefully. The temperature of the hot spring not only determines the type of snacks you should choose, but also the amount of time you should spend in the water. To bathe in a hot spring is to completely empty your mind. As such, swimming around the pool is incredibly disruptive and impolite, and something you should absolutely not learn from Mualani. Hey! <sighs> All right, looks like you were able to adapt to the temperature, no problem. You should be able to switch to the natural springs then. Well, I've got to get going. Oh, and make sure you drink your milk. I'm looking at you, Mualani. <sighs> I still remember how you used to pour it into the water when you were little. <sighs> that better not happen again, whether I'm here to catch you or not. Ugh, okay, okay. Paimon didn't think you were the type to do something like that. <laughs> I remember thinking I'd totally get away with it, too. But turns out milk is pretty easy to spot when you pour it into clear water. Hmm, not my best work.